5 minute daily practice for your Duolingo English test. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm teacher Lida from IELTSAhead.com and in this series I'll bring you 5 minute daily preparation for your Duolingo test that will help you improve your performance and also give you confidence to pass the exam. So hit the subscribe button and join our classes. Don't forget to head over to my website to get some extra practice on the Duolingo English test and also the latest info. I will leave the link here in the description below. Also, you can find all my Duolingo courses to help you prepare and get ready for the DET. You can find full Duolingo tests, writing courses and speaking courses. All of them have the answer key and they come with PDF support. So take advantage of the courses and the free practice that you find on my website and keep on going. There's no difference in the results. His specialty is English literature. This image shows a young fisherman carrying a swordfish on top of his head. The fish must be approximately one and a half meters long, and based on that, I assume it must also be heavy to carry out of the water. The water looks calm and peaceful since there are no waves and it's a low tide. 
In the background, there's a white fishing boat where another fisherman is standing at the bow, looking toward the one leaving the water. As this is such a large animal, it probably was extremely hard to handle by one person, so I think they might have caught it together. Pat refused to give her any information about Sarah, 